Hello, I'm Nathan Judy. I'm here with West Brom reporter Steve Maidley. Steve, so much to discuss, but let's start with that crazy FA Cup draw. It was always going to happen, wasn't it? Yeah, it, it, it did seem like it was fated, I mean, especially given the dates of it. They, they played Villa on Tuesday night and at Villa Park, and now they're back to Villa Park at the weekend. We're not sure of the date of that game yet, but yeah, two, two derbies at Villa Park within the space of a week. And two massive games as well. One going to Wembley, obviously an FA Cup semi-final. And the other one, I mean, arguably more important as yeah, well. Yeah, absolutely. I mean, certainly financially, the, the, the first game, the league game, is more important because if, if, if Albion could go there and get, and get a win, it would, it would deal a massive blow to Villa's um, survival hopes and, and, and vice versa. So that, that it, it, the, the head says that's the bigger game. The heart probably says the FA Cup game is, is the big one. And of course, Tim Sherwood now appointed manager. Two, two, two new head coaches going to go into battle. Yeah, yeah. It's certainly, in terms of this picture, and interesting, of course, that Tim Sherwood has twice or almost got the Albion job and now find himself managing against Albion in, in two massive fixtures. Uh, Villa Park, obviously, there are empty, some empty seats against the Leicester game, but I'm pretty sure that it'll be very close to a full house. Um, yeah, so, yeah. I mean, I mean, Albion will, will sell it their allocation that they always do for, for Villa Park. Uh, I think, I'm sure the last two derbies at Villa Park, Villa haven't quite sold it. I mean, it's a big ground, obviously, but, but certainly for the cup game, they might make an exception. But obviously, going head to head for a place at Wembley. And the atmosphere will be just something else. In both, in both games. I mean, it, it's a fixture that's become, that's really grown in the last few years. It was always a big fixture. And then we went through a few years where it wasn't played very often, and, um, and Albion Wolves became, became the big one. But this fixture in the last three or four years has really grown again into something really special. It's the game that certainly Albion fans, I think, I think want to win more than any other. And, and going in full of confidence with that fantastic result on, on Saturday. Yeah, I mean, we've not been able to say it very often, but back-to-back -back good performances from Albion. I mean, they play, play, play very well against, against Swansea. Uh, in, in the league, and then even better um, against West Ham in the cup. I would, say, I would say that cup game against West Ham is probably probably the best they've played over 90 minutes for a good couple of years, probably since the first year of Steve Clark's reign. And they haven't won an FA Cup tie against Villa for, for quite a while, I think, 90 years or so. Yeah, yeah, I, I, so, so I understand. I mean, I, I don't know how many times they've played in that in that, in that time, but it's, it's going to be a hell, hell of a big game. Yeah, it's going to be an absolute belter. You can hear plenty more from me and Steve exclusively at expressandstar.com.